Okay, so I'm gonna fill out a truth table. So, x implies z. So if x is true and t is true, then x, impl x implies z is true. If, so then let's do this one. If z implies not x, then when the case where z and x are both true, that's false. All right, let's, let's do this situation. X implies Z, but F, or sorry, oh my God. So X implies Z, X is true, Z is false. This makes that false. How about this one? Z implies not X, but not Z. So that's true. Because in the case where Z is false, it does not imply anything about X. So that's fine. It's vacuously true. All right. Now you've got the case where X is false and Z is true. This is true because when not x then we don't know anything about z and so this is once again vacuously true Let's see if z is true and the next false yep that's just basically stating what that implication is so that's true and now let's see this one so x is false and z is false well Z X not X so we, so does not say anything about Z so that's true. Now this one not Z so Z is false therefore we don't have to say that it doesn't matter what X is so we say this is also true and so the cases where both premises are true are the case are the, all cases where X is false. Therefore, x is false. In every other case, one or the other of the premises is false. But in these cases, all premises are true. So but either of these worlds is valid. There, that's it.